good end to phase two, what we call phase two spring ball. Uh, we got to finish strong academically now, finish the semester, and then get into our summer program, uh, continue competitions at, at all these positions, and uh, see who's going to, you know, rise to the top. We know some positions, but uh, we want our guys competing um, always at a high level. But uh, we had some guys make some plays out there. Thought Benny ran the ball nice. Uh, you know, Calvin ran it nice. So, um, you know, we just, we just got to continue to get better, and that's phase three as we go into the summer. Now the guys know the offense, know the defense. Uh, they'll be able to, you know, lead us through summer and summer workouts and throw Skelly against each other and, and continue to get better as we move into uh, phase four, which is our August camp. Well, he gives us a real good dimension out of the backfield. Uh, he's played a lot of wide receiver. Um, in his, you know, in his career, and and he's a, we got really good hands. He's a very athletic guy, uh, so we've been really pleased with him. Um, we had moved him to wide receiver. I kind of, you know, made him move back to running back because I think he can really affect our team there. Uh, I think he can be a real contributor there in in certain situations. So I've been really proud of Calvin the spring he's had, uh, how hard he's working, and that's been my challenge to him is, you know, continue to work one day at a time. And, you know, I think good things can happen for him. So I thought he did a nice job tonight. He's getting better at running the ball. And we know he can do good things in the open field with when he catches it. So we've got to continue that track. But I thought, I thought all of our running backs have done a nice job this spring catching the ball out of the backfield. I thought, I thought uh, you know, Benny, I think, has got some of the best hands on the team. These two guys sitting here are really good catchers of the football. So I think it gives us a good dimension to add. Phase three is really all in summer workout where they really just they just get out there in the heat of the summer and grind on conditioning. Uh, it's no easy way to do it. It's uh, it's probably the hardest hardest phase in football for your for your year round. That that the phase three in the summer is just there's no easy way about it. You just have to get out in the heat and run, and put yourself in a position to to give yourself an opportunity to be productive in August. Um, you know, summer conditioning's hard, and it's it, but it has to be done, and hopefully it keeps you from getting injured. That's one of the biggest things. You know, the weight room and conditioning. Hopefully, that keeps you out of the training room. But there's no easy way around it. You just gotta you gotta go out and work. You know what's ahead of you. We've everybody's played the game, understands that summertime is is critical, and and yet it's probably the hardest time of the year. Um, I mean, it's it's no way around. It. It's gonna be hard regardless. Uh, waking up at four o'clock definitely. Uh, you gotta. You know, just coming with that mindset of you got to come to work. Um, you know, and they, I trust these guys with all my heart to you know, get us prepared and get us ready for the season to come. So just wake up every morning and trust them. Yeah, I thought it was pretty good. You know, uh, they moved around pretty good, uh, made a couple plays down the field. I thought Hassan did. I thought uh, Chris did. Uh, you know, we'll have to watch the – obviously go back and watch it and just con continue to battle at that position. Uh, that's going to be an open competition here through August. And – you know, we'll name a starter, but I like the the progress the guys are making. Uh, you know, we we did some nice things out there and got pretty good command of of our offense. Now we've been doing it for five weeks, so it's gotten a little bit easier for them. Uh, you know, so I've been I've been pleased with them. It was I was thankful for the opportunity. You know, it was great that we had everybody out there today. You know, it was um it was a higher speed was since the last time I've been on a real game field. You know, but it was fun getting out there with all the guys. Everybody did a great job from OL, receiver, running back. We all just had fun out there today. It was just fun being out there. Yeah, same same with Chris said. Uh, it was fun getting back out there, just enjoying it, um, playing with my teammates. You know, it's faster. So, you know what I'm saying? We just got to pick up the pace with it. So, I mean, catching on as I go, but, you know, still more to learn. Um, yeah, it's, um, it's, it's been awesome. Just uh, Coach Spencer coming in, you know, just um, the new schemes. We, I think we've uh, applied to it really well, um, you know, the new – uh, he's got pass rush packages for us. He's got third down packages, different packages. So I think the whole defense is just adjusting to it. And I really like the, um, the energy that he's bringing. Uh, you know, say someone makes a play or someone gets a sack, you know, he, he wants us all to get energetic for the team. So I think uh, Coach Pinnis is doing a great job just uh, getting us all together and um, just bringing us closer to the defense. Um, I think I played all right. I missed a couple reads and I had to scramble my way out of them. You know, I still have a lot of learning and work to do. And just being around the quarterbacks we have out there is really awesome because I'm learning a lot from Hassan and Brooks. And just being with uh, all those guys is really making me a better player and better person. And we all have a great relationship in the quarterback room. And we're just enjoying it being out there together. Yeah, our staff's really come together well. They they're all springs through the, through the winter and, and spring ball. They've done a, a nice job together. It's just it's got a good feel to it. Uh, 
whether it's Coach West, Coach Spencer, you know, Coach Selfo coming in, uh, you know, kind of getting in here at the last minute for spring ball. All the guys have done a good job and they've gelled, gelled well together. So I just feel really good about where we are as a staff and they're working good together and we'll continue to, you know, progress as we move through August. But uh, today went well and it's a little, it was a little difficult for the coordinators because they had to go back and forth with two sidelines. So that was a little difficult on them. But uh, communication is really good right now. Well, think it's really the same thing out of our, our first team defense uh, that we've been seeing all spring, just being real aggressive uh, with our offense. Uh, I like their attitude. I like their effort. I like how aggressive they're being and, and the attitude they're playing with. So uh, we're creating some lost yardage plays, which we need to. Uh, I think I think they got the one third down on, on our green defense. Uh, and that's been an emphasis for us this spring. I thought they did a better job uh, today with that. So. Um, We'll, you know, once we get digging into the film, but I, I just been really proud of our defense and their energy level. Well, it's just, uh, you know, it's just a matter of people seeing us now for for three full seasons in Division One football. So it's just it's just natural that, you know, hopefully you're recruiting better and you're getting better players, uh, you know. But uh, you know, 16 was a good year for us when you had all those old guys in the first class of 2012. So. Um, yeah, I've been proud of our guys since we've been here, but uh, we just we got to keep we got to continue to progress and get better and keep recruiting well and and go out and and win games. You know, I've, every spring game's been really good from my standpoint. Uh, when you look at the crowd, our, you know, our fans are they're hungry. They want us to be successful. They want us to win. They show up and and they cheer for us. So uh, we got to continue to to get better and and keep recruiting.